Hey guys, what's up? Today we got a problem that's looking at directional derivatives. So first of all, the problem says find all points at which the direction of fastest change of the function is this vector. So what exactly does that mean? This function f changes at every point, and if you look in different directions, it has different rates of change. So we want to know where or what points x, y does this function have a fastest rate of change that's in the direction of this vector? So we know the fastest rate of change occurs in the direction of the gradient. So we're going to look at the direction of the gradient being parallel to this vector 1, 1. So that's really the problem we've got to solve. At what points x, y is the gradient parallel to this vector 1, 1? And k is just going to be a constant that denotes that these two vectors are parallel. So what is the gradient of this function? The gradient of this function is equal to 2x minus 2 and then 2y minus 4. Now, if we set the gradient equal to k times this vector, we get two equations. So 2x minus 2 equals k and then 2y minus 4 equals k then we get two equations but three unknowns. So let's eliminate one of the variables. Let's eliminate the k variable by equating these two. So then we can say 2x minus 2 is equal to 2y minus 4. Divide everything by 2, and we can say that x minus 1 is equal to y minus 2. Now just solve for y, and we can say y is equal to x plus 1. Aha, uh -huh. so every point on this line has a fastest, a direction of fastest change that's parallel to this vector 1, 1. So that tells us this function, if we were to take the gradient at the points on this line, the, the gradient at that point or those points will be parallel to this vector i hat j hat. So that's the set of points x comma x plus 1. So that's what we do.